to our channel. This is my nine week old puppy Daisy and I'm going to be showing you guys everything I got for my dog as a first time pet owner. Everything I got was from TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Walmart, Chewy, PetSmart, and Pet. The thing I have for her is this food. This is the Royal Canine puppy food. This is in the small size. Um, I was recommended this and she eats it pretty well. There's nothing really special about it. All right. Next up for food things, we have this bowl holder, which came with these two little pink bowls that say thirsty and feed me. And I got these both from Home Goods. And I think they were $10, which isn't bad. And they hold a cup of food each. So those are great. And then I have these bowls also, which I got from Chewy. And I think these were $2 each. And they also hold a cup of food each. Okay. So the next thing we have is nail clippers. And these are the nail clippers I got her. And they have a little safety guard. I got these actually from the dollar store. And... I haven't tried them yet, so I'm not sure how they work, but they have decent reviews online. The next thing we have is a slicker brush. This is a small dog slicker brush that I got from Marshalls. And I believe this was $4, and it works pretty well. And so yeah. Next thing I also have is another brush, and it's a pin brush and a, like, that material, I guess you could say. I don't know what you would call that. But um, I got this from Five Below, and it was about $4.25. Some toothpaste, and this is the ProSense toothpaste enzymatic formula, and it comes in a set with this little toothbrush that's the big and the little side, as well as a small little finger brush for your dog. And this smells like mint. This is the shampoo I got her. It's the Pet Lovers 360 shampoo for daily grooming. I got this from Chewy and it smells like sweet aloe. Um, the smell is not very strong. It doesn't last very long either, but it is really mild. So if you have a puppy, this is great and you can use it every day. The next thing we have is these multi-pet pet wipes and there's hundreds of these and they come, I got these from Walmart and they are $3.30 for 100 so it's a pretty good deal, and they do work really Some poop bags, I got these from Five Below, and they were $5 for 240 poop bags. And we also bought the holder, and you just hook this onto your pet's leash, and it does make things a lot easier when you So the next category we have is training, and the first thing we have are these fruitables bacon and apple treats and I got these from Marshalls for $2.99 and I would definitely recommend getting some sort of treat like this that has pumpkin because that's really good for your dog's digestive health and the next type of treat we have are these train me these I think it says yeah 500 treats in there and I got this from Marshalls for five dollars and I also I haven't tried these but they're the Pet Botanics Mini Training Rewards. And there's 200 in there, and these are chicken flavor. These are also chicken flavor, and then these are bacon and apple flavor. And then also for training, we have two clickers. I got these off of Amazon for $5, and I just use these and I click it, and I give her a treat, which is a really good way of training. Do you want a treat? She wants a treat. And so yeah. These treats are really good and my dog really, really likes them. We have this My Pet's Friend Pet Stain Odor and Urine Remover. And this is the Strong Enzyme Powder. And I use this when she has accidents on the wood. And then I got this from Dollar Tree and I also got this from Dollar Tree. And it's the Pet Fresh Carpet Cleaner with OxyClean. And I would definitely recommend this. You can use this to clean your pet's bedding and also your carpets if they have an accident or just to keep the carpet. The next thing we have are pee pads and I got extra large pee pads from Carl. The first toy we have 
is this taco, and I got this from PetSmart, and it makes a crinkle sound, and it also squeaks. Yeah, you want your, you want your taco? That's one of her favorite toys. And then the next toy we have is this little stuffed animal with a... And then the next toy we have is this little butterfly I got from Chewy. And I put this in the freezer for her, and she really, really likes it. And it's just like a soft toy and it has different textures. Then we have this little rope that I got from Walmart. And it has a rope and this harder part. And this was, I think, 89 cents. So I would definitely check in store if you can because they typically have some really, really good sales. And I do know that right now PetSmart has its big sale of pet toys. So if you're getting a dog, you should check it out. Or if you already have a dog, you should still get them something. And I also have this from PetSmart, and it's this little pig, and this is one of my favorite toys for her. And if you're on a budget, this is also a really great toy because it squeaks. It is a ball. It's good for teething. This parts are like a rubber, <laughs> and then it has like these noodles that are like soft. And we have this other pig from PetSmart, and it just squeaks, and it's a really cute toy. And I give this we have is this ginormous fox. And I got this from PetSmart for $5, and there's actually a chicken inside of it, so if your dog tears it open, there's another toy inside of it that it makes a really big squeak. And it's actually quite a bit bigger than she is, so or about the same size almost, but it's a really good toy. And then next we have this little rope, and I got this from Chewy, and yeah, it's just a rope. And then next we have this bone and this is from PetSmart. The next thing I have for her is a cat toy and it's actually just a treat dispensing ball from the brand Whisker City at PetSmart. And we have this pack of Nyla bones. One is for dental and one just a pack of three little Kong tennis balls that are super tiny and these are great. And the last couple of things I have I got this big basket, which is where I keep all of her stuff in. I got this from Five Below for $5, and it's a pretty nice basket. It's a pretty big size, and I use that to keep all her stuff. No, 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 no. Not that. And then I also have this crate pad, which I have not given her yet, but I got this from PetSmart, and this goes in the bottom of the dog's crate, and just use that for them. And then I have her bed here with all of her stuff on top of it. But here's her bed. I got this from TJ Maxx for $12. And it's a pretty nice bed. It's also reversible, which is kind of cool. So it has that texture. And then it also has this texture. And then I have a crate and a playpen, which I'll insert clips of because those are too big to... This is Daisy's crate with the cover on it. And then there's the bedding in there and just a little stuffed animal. And then if you close this, you can put this on top and it'll be This is the playpen that I was talking about. And here I just keep her bed, some stuffed animals, a pee pad, and her food and water bowls, and a ball. This playpen is great and then it has a door that opens right there and another door that opens here. And then it comes with the pockets and it comes with a mesh top so you could close it if your dog jumps out. Thank you all so, so much for watching our first video together. I hope this was helpful for anyone who's getting a dog or if you just like watching this sort of content. So yeah, pause out.